Hi everybody, girls and boys. Welcome to my channel, Kawaii Panda here. If you're new here, hi, my name is Panda for short. Welcome to the Panda Fam. If while you're here, hit that subscribe button. Also hit that bell so you're officially in the Panda Fam. And comment down below hashtag Panda hashtag Panda Fam hashtag Panda's underrated. Hashtag, I love you, Panda. And I'll give you a shout out in the next video. For those people that have been subscribed to me. Hi, welcome back. Thank you for coming back. Nice seeing you. Um, We got a bunch of slimes to review today. So we got to get started. And I got to keep the intro short. Alright, guys. Um... I hope you enjoyed my other videos that I posted up. If you want to see any of my other videos, then then just click on my channel and go watch them all. I do playlists, so it make it easier for you. Um, so let's get started. All right, guys. So for our, we have a bunch of um slimes to review today. Now I do have um, a box from Val Slimes, which I won't be reviewing in this video, sadly. Val, just so you know, I didn't forget you, but I'm waiting for your another your the other box to come. I don't want you to think that I left you out. You know you're my friend. You are my peoples. You're my bestie. You know that, my friend. <laughs> um, me and Val are tight. You know. So my first slime is from Slime Chimp. I, now, I, I go on his site to order supplies. Um, his marshmallow beads are amazing. I actually ordered a bunch of these to make some Captain Crunch and um, and other stuff. You know, they're amazing. They're he, his, he's he's amazing. I mean, I'm thinking it's a he. I hate that. I hate that. I don't know what who, if a slime like creator is a he or a she. I just always call them he. Oh, <laughs> he, she. I don't know. Um. So I I per I officially went on there and purchased a bunch of these, but then I saw that he had slime for five dollars. Five dollars slime. I am there. Five dollars slime. Make you hella. <laughs> That was so stupid. <laughs> anyway, he wrapped it up very nicely like this. Um, I don't have the official box that it came in because I just don't. <laughs> um, I just put it. I have an actual review box that I I put all my reviews, my slimes I had need a review in together, and that's how I do. Unless it, I don't take them out the box. Sometimes I don't. I like to unbox them in front of you. Um, but I, I knew this was, wasn't going to be anything, like, super special. It was just going to be, you know, what I ordered, and then the slime. I don't think he does, he does business cards or anything like that. I'm pretty sure he don't. He should, because I love his logo. Oh my god, his logo is so cute! It is so, so cute. That little monkey, oh god. And you can, um, follow him at Slime Champ. Which is chimp like a chimp monkey. Um, and you can go to www.slimechimp.com to purchase his products. He sells these in all different colors. Rainbow and yellow and blue and it, all different colors. And he also sells slime and he sells other stuff. But I go there for his marshmallow beads because they're amazing and they're hard to find. So let's see. I never tried his slime before so I'm really excited to try these out. I got some new pink scissors guys. Look at this. They were not cheap. Okay. <laughs> Target does not play around when it comes to their prices. But it did come in. A, it, I was like they're um for breast cancer so I think a certain proceeds goes to breast cancer awareness which is what I support because I know a few people that had breast cancer so I always if I can support breast cancer awareness, I will. He wrapped it up really nice. You know, nothing spilled. And he also, oh my god, I want, Slime, Slime Champ, I want to, how do you do this, like, wrap? I want to do this to my slimes. 
Um, how do you do this? Can you message me, DM me on Instagram, and let me know how you do like the seal like that? Because I want to start doing. I want to do it to mine. So I love that he seals them like that. Like especially because it's a deli container, and you know my deli containers lock. So. I mean, I would love to have that extra protection. So if you can tell me how to do that, that would be amazing, Slime Chimp. Um, because they, they, they were not nice with this package. It's all bumped up and everything, but because he puts that seal, it's protected. I'll always be asking, like, because I'm friends with a few um, slime creators, slime shop owners, like big slime shop owners, and um. I'm always asking them questions, and they always are so friendly. Like Rotom, um, Rotom Slimes, the um, are, is the friendliest person I've ever known. Slime Champs logo right there it is so so cute. I love that little monkey. It's so cute. They, you need to get little squishies made of that monkey, or little like mochis made of it, or something like. I I need some kind of merch that has that logo, a t-shirt, something, because that monkey is to die for. Uh, not to die for, but, you know. So this is a banana nut bread. <laughs> I love that he puts not edible. That's amazing. You see that? That is so cute that he says not edible. Because... <laughs> If it smells that good, that I might eat it. I don't know. All right, that's all we're getting. Oh, it smells so good. Oh my god. Hmm. It smells just like what it is. Banana nut bread. Oh my god. Where do you get your sense? Because oh, I need to be on that. I need the sense. So I, I, I definitely think it's a glossy but because I can feel like the oil on my hand like it's wet a little bit It's taking so long It's definitely a Thick arms you can't even see It's nice and soft. Oh, oh, there's like a little banana, banana in here. Oh, add that to my slot, my charms. All right, so it comes with like a little banana charm, which is so, so cute. Definitely looks like it's got some clay in it and it's definitely like it's got a, it's got like a jelly texture to it I don't this might be a butter slime I can't tell because I can't get on his website but Maybe a slice slime. Oh, that was a fail. It's not very stretchy. Like you gotta stretch it super slow. Which is kind of weird because it's not that thick. But for some reason, but I like that it's not sticking to me. I like that there is definitely clay in the here because I can see it. Like I can just see the clay because it goes. It goes from like 
matte to glossy. I like this because I have nails. Okay, I would give it a. I'll give it an 8 out of a 10. I love the scent. Um, it's. I don't like jiggly slimes because they don't. They're not interactive. They don't like make noises or anything. That's why it's an 8. And it's kind of wet. And I don't like that feeling. But the scent is amazing. And I kind of. I don't know. Something about how. It, I like how it looks when you play with it. Like it just looks. So. I don't know. Something about it. I can't, I can't stop playing with it. But I don't like the. I, I don't know. I don't know. I like it but I don't like it. <laughs> but because of the scent. The scent is giving it an 8 because that scent is amazing. Alright, this is actually from R Rotom's. Um, I can never pronounce their name. Um, Rotom's when I don't have. So let's get everything out of this container. Now this company is known for their um, DIY slimes. They're kind of like um, fantastic slimes. They did DIYs, um, but they're different. I love your new logos. I don't know what this logo is about. Is this your new logo or is it just for the slime? I adore that logo. Oh my god, we're talking about the logo. You can't even see the logo because it's marked. So that you always get a free slime with your purchase. No matter if you buy one or two whatever I, you always get a free two ounce slime which is so super cute um he gave me a free slime because he's my friend she gave me <laughs> sorry she gave me a free slime because we are friends on instagram and we're pretty you know we're pretty tight in a way where i can ask her Hey, can you help me out with a free slime? And she gives me a two ounce slime. That kind of that kind of friendship. Not like, can you give me a free slime? And she gives me five slimes. That would have been amazing. I would have tried. But no, it's I'm I, I'm appreciative, and I appreciate anything that you give me. Thank you so much for giving me the extra slime. I I love your shop. You, you know I do. She hooked me up with a discount code, and I was on it. Boom. I always support them. When I can support her so shop, I will. She's on the pricier end of slimes, so it's harder for me to, to buy a lot of slimes from her because her prices are in like the $15 range because I won't buy no less than 8 ounces. That's just how I am. So, um, because they're on the higher end of price range, I can't really buy a lot of slimes from her at once and without because I like to buy from different companies and I have fr I have like Slimer sh shop friends that you know I promise that I buy from them so I have to like spread it out a little bit and they he, she came at the end of my haul so I didn't really have much money but I don't know I apologize I hate next time I'm gonna put them put you first and next time, my next haul, and I'm going to buy more than just one slime from you, I promise. Because you're always good to me, and we're, we're cool. Just so you know, this is one of the slimes that I'll be selling in my shop. It's uh, it's a um, Galaxy Slime, but it's not called Galaxy Slime. I forget what it's called. <laughs> I love how they package their slimes. <coughs> Like, they do so well. They use bubble wrap, and they they make sure nothing is going to happen to their slime. So, let's open these babies up. I'm excited. I always get excited when, um, when I'm opening up, like, people that I know, like, people that I talk to slime packages. Um, I get excited when I'm opening any slime packages. Let's keep it real, Panda. Okay? I love slime. I am a... I love, 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 love slime. That's why I open up the slime shop, because I'm very good at making slime, too. This is adorable. This is why I love ordering from them. Like this kind of stuff. Like this is amazing. Like it looks like a vanilla, like a vanilla ice cream with chocolate on top. 
how did you do the chocolate? That is so cool. That is so amazing. See, they're so creative. Ah! Oh. Rotom slimes. Oh my god, so in, you get a little extra pack and it's a little piggy. It's a little piggy and um and some chocolate bits. I don't know what these chocolate bits are, but it has to be clay. It has to be, right? Yeah, it has to be clay. They're so ugh. They're amazing. They are amazing. Um, if you have not ordered from Rotom Slimes, you need to because they are amazing. Amazing. They are so creative. There's so many slimes that I want from them that I every time I go to buy it, that they're sold out. I want your ice cream slimes. Send me your ice cream cream slimes to review. Please. <laughs> No, I honestly like there's slimes that I want and every time I go to buy them they're sold out. It makes me so mad. So mad. Alright, so we finally got her all, all her slimes open. So this right here, this right here is one slime. This is this go is gonna be going in there. And this is their extra slime and this let's this is their thank you slime, and this goes with that. Let's see what their thank you is. It's mushroom Michelin cream soup. Oh, so this is like something that like you didn't order. Like last time when I got my extra, it was actually something that I ordered. So I just thought they gave me an extra like some. Their slime textures are amazing. Oh my god! That smells. I I see mushroom and I literally freak. This smells so good. So if you order, you gotta order this mushroom Michelin cream soup slime. Oh, it's not, it's like a savory scent, but it's a sweet scent. It's so amazing. Oh my God. And their textures are just to die. All right, let's, let's play with this a little bit. Oh my God. To die, to die. I'm dead. I'm, I'm deceased. It smells so good. Like, I thought it was going to smell nasty because, like, mushrooms. But no, sir. No, ma'am. It smells delicious. She, I just asked her what scent it was. She will not tell me scent. She does not give scents out. It's literally amazing. It's a butter slime. I would love a big thing of this. This is so nice on the hands. Like, it's just so creamy and so soft and smells so good. Like, I can just smell it. Ugh. This is a two ounce and it inflated. Their slimes inflate. Oh, also, the, I totally missed out on this because I got so excited. If they come with um, a borax packet that has probably, it looks like a half a teaspoon. Um, of Brax and their business card 
and two candies, two Jolly Ranchers, and this is their business card. And I'll put all their information down below. And their care sheet is on the back. They're like warning sheet. And they I like that they do they do what I actually got that from them. Um put in my business card between the borax and the candy so it keeps it separated. Very smart. So that's your extras, your little extra packet. And then and you also get a two ounce slime as an extra. Oh my god, this is so nice. Oh, it smells like a candle. It smells like Jolly Ranchers. Oh my god. It smells like a Jolly Rancher. It's, it's a jelly slime. It's so nice. Already. Just going to be amazing. <sighs> Let's play with this first. Oh, that texture, guys. I need you to be able to see this. That texture is amazing. It's a butter slime. It's like, it's like a butter, it's like a slave butter slime. I don't know. I, I don't even know what I'm talking about anymore. Her slimes are amazing. She definitely puts clay in like every one of her slimes you can tell because that's what, how they get inflate. And it's kind of like a cream cheese type slime. It reminds me of. Oh my god. I just want to enjoy this for a moment. Let's open this baby up. How do you open it? Oh my god. Okay. Oh, this all. Oh, I thought she gave me an extra two ounce. So I think normally she she doesn't give you like an actual slime like in your two ounce she doesn't give you like a name slime I guess um she gave me an actual name slime instead of what she usually gives I guess I don't know all right so this goes on there so this goes on here this goes on here with the little chocolate bits. I have to hurry because everything's like melting. Okay. Winky wink, pink pig. And then take this off and wrinkle okay so look how pretty this is like this is coming off the side this is so pretty I will have a picture of what like that I took don't worry. <laughs>
guys like making a mess this is so it's just everything it's just everything bits her slimes are the longest to review because there's so much to them I don't know she says she's gave me an extra sign but she I don't know I'm so confused take that little pig out I don't like playing with slime with my charms do you I usually take my charms right out like as soon as I'm done with them like done like doing my little like pictures and stuff I take my charms out Those slimes are so thick, too, and so heavenly. Oh my god, amazing. It's not going to fit in this container either. I'm going to have to get another container. I'm going to have to get another container. Every time. Hold on. If you get something from Rodham Slimes, Radham Slimes, Rodham Slimes, I don't know how to pronounce it. You will need another container because look, this is like a six ounce of slime. If I play with it even more, it will turn into, I would say a seven ounce. Look, it's a half of an eight ounce of slime. <laughs> That's almost eight ounces of slime right there. Extra. Extra, extra, read all about it. Amazing. Amazing. I am never disappointed when it comes to their slimes. They are my heart. <laughs> I love your slimes. Oh, my hands smell so good. Um, you're, you, you're a magician. You know exactly what you're doing. And you're doing a fantastic job at it, guys. God, you're amazing. You are amazing. I love you. I love you. I love you. <laughs> I love you. I want every one of your slimes. Big box. Send me. I wish. 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 But yeah, if you don't know about Rodham slimes. You best go get some of their slimes. Their slimes are top notch, amazing. They're this. They're one of my top favorite slimes. And I only, I only have a few that are my top favorite slimes. I don't think every slime is a favorite. This slime is, um, is a, is a 9.5 out of 10. The only reason I'm not giving it a 10 is because I am going to need some glycerin for this because it is a bit stiff now that I, I put the clay in. So just know that she should have provided some glycerin with this slime because once the clay was mixed it got a bit tough and it was like I could definitely rip it if I wanted to um so I'm definitely going to add a little bit of glycerin um to it so if you have glycerin or hair gel just add a little bit when you get slimes some of her slimes she includes glycerin some of them she doesn't I think she should include them with all her slimes just in case um this one definitely needed glycerin, and thankfully I have it. Um, it just happens when you mix clay with slime, it's going to happen, it's going to get tough, and it's going to get th thicker than it was, and it's not her fault whatsoever. It's an amazing slime, it smells so amazing, and this one that, I, that um, she gave me, Mushroom Michelin Cream Soup, 
Oh my god. It, I'm buying this. Next time I buy from her, I am buying this slime. Because it smells so good. Oh, it smells so delicious. And I, I, I have to have this. I have to have this slime. slime. They're amazing. Go purchase from them. I'll leave the, their um, contact information down below. Definitely go purchase from them. They're, they're, their prices are a little higher than usual, but not that bad. Um, they're $15 for 8 ounces. And you're getting clay. It's, it's because of everything that you're getting. That's why the price is so high. It is so worth it. Unicorn slimes. This is I don't do many famous famous um slime shops. I would say, um, oh my god, I would say um, Rotom Slimes is a famous slime shop to me. I think so. Um, twenty k followers. I would say a famous slime shop, but. They don't do YouTube or anything like that. I don't know if they're considered famous. I don't see them a lot. But I consider them a famous slime shop. I actually have a video, another video that I need to post up of me reviewing their slimes. I don't, I'm so slow when it comes to editing. But since I've been trying to open my slime business, I've been slacking on my videos. Arr! Okay. I need to get on it but this is unicorn slimes let me tell you about Anthony um, Joseph Anthony I love him he is a doll I wish he was my best friend Joseph Anthony if you watch this video which you probably won't because I am just nobody I'm a little little fish in a big big pond of YouTube but if you do watch this video I love you <laughs> and I want to be your best friend can we do a slime trade <laughs> can we do something can we hang out can we talk can we text can we anything <laughs> I want you to be my best friend I love him I watch him every single day all day long like his videos are amazing amazing his personality is that's amazing. So this is how it, they beat up his box. Like I don't know what you did to the the um, USPS, but they beat my box up. They must not like you. What did you do to them? Hopefully everything is safe. I got a whole bunch of stuff in here. Ah! So I got three slimes and the only thing I say is this is a little unprofessional. The ripped paper, um, you could have cut it. Come on unicorn slimes, come on Joseph Anthony. You are a big, bigger company, you know, scissors wouldn't have hurt. You lose a point for that. You do. You know best, better than anything. The, the experience is everything. And, and this is unprofessional. A ripped piece of paper. Whoever packed this box, you need to slap their hand. Because this was not a good thing. Ripping a piece of paper. They could have used scissors. Tweezer, they you can use toenail clippers, something, a knife, I don't know, but not ripping it like that. That looks so bad. It doesn't look good. Okay, don't. That doesn't look good. All right, so we got there his business card right here, which is weird because there's like, it's not. I think I ordered something that came with a um with markers or something everything is perfect <laughs> everything's perfect I got a little egg yeah I, I think this goes with the egg everything's wrapped in bubble wrap 
It's not like taped or anything, but it's wrapped in bubble wrap. And then this one is taped. This is the only one that is taped. I guess some of them are just slanted and they need a fall. Alright, so I would think that like Alright, so he gave me I would think that he would have like all this stuff in a bag instead of spread all over the box like it is. It's kind of weird. I have I was it's the experience that I'm experiencing right now with his box is not what I expected. I I was thinking it was going to be like beautiful and like packed really nice and like pink bubble bubble wrap or something I don't know I, I was expecting a little more than I received I don't think there's actually anything in this egg and he does have fragile on the box so whatever happened to the box was not his fault Let's see if there's something in here oh there is clay in there okay <laughs> All right, so we got our pop, our little um, cake pop, which goes to this is to Winky. This goes to this. Okay, it's falling down. Okay, this goes to this, and I think the markers go with the egg, and you're supposed to decorate the egg or something. And you got um, the candies. This is the candies. I got two blow pops, uh, Jelly Rancher, this goes to the pop, the cake pop, two bubble gums, I don't, the thing is, I don't like gum, but I will suck these, um, lollipops, I just don't like gum, I don't, it's a texture thing, so I suck on gum, and then I give it to my fiance, <laughs> I suck on it a little bit, and then I give it to him, um, and he gave me two things of borax, which is awesome, thank you. I would think he would have had this all in like a little bag though like it's I don't know I just thought he would be a little more professional with the, the ripped the ripped invoice and everything not being in a bag it's just like kind of ruined my spirits about how I would receive well I would, how I would receive his his product so thank you for the candies, the extras, and the two the two borax packets. Obviously, I don't need them because I um, create slime. I make my own slime, so I have borax. But that is awesome that he he provided two packs. Um, I'm really upset about this. This is really upsetting because he is unicorn slimes. He complains about stuff like this, and for him to complain about stuff like this, and then him to do it? No. Bad boy. I think it's cute. Let's open our markers. I love me some markers, so that is awesome. Do they smell like different stuff? That doesn't smell like anything. I don't know. Let me get his little ripped piece of paper. No. I don't think it would be scented. Let me just look on the pack. This is oh, almost lost my egg. Washable, lava, liquid, lavables, shuckins. Once you shut up, you can't stop. They're washable markers. Special marker collection, sell makes shopkins, cute characters, inspired by items from your favorite shots. Once you shop, you cannot stop. Pretty little washable markers, easy to wash from skin and most clothing. Uh, you get desert flower, this one, jelly bean blue, and mini brown, which is this one. And you just get cute characters on the markers, which is really cute. I like that. So, but I think you're supposed to do you're supposed to draw on your egg, which is weird because it's coming out blue. What the heck? Or maybe you're supposed to draw on your. I don't know what you're supposed to draw on. I love Travis. You know my boo. I don't know if you're supposed to draw one your actual. We're going to do this one first. Let's actually, this thing keeps rolling around. Let's actually, look at that bubble. Ooh. Oh. 
goals, okay? God, you get it so thick. Oh, I don't like that smell that much. I don't know what that smell is, but Shopkins Easter egg. Yeah, this, this scent is bothersome. I don't know what that is. I don't like it. So what I think is happens is there is clay in here. And I think you're supposed to write on the clay, maybe? <laughs> Let's see. I... Love. Travis. Travis is my fiance. I don't know what the hell you're supposed to. I don't know what you're supposed to do with these markers and with the the, the clay and with the slime and with everything. He doesn't explain anything, which would have been really nice if he did. For people that don't like watch his videos, but they shop at his shop, like it would have been nice to know. Like, what am I supposed to do, Anthony Joseph Anthony? Like, hello, what am I supposed to do with this? these markers and with all this you can't write on an egg because the egg's blue i'm trying to get all this clay out he does make some really nice and thick um slime i'm jealous i want to make slime that thick what is your secret what is it because i want to know okay and we are friends now so you gotta tell me your secret to your thickies okay well, how do you make your slime so thick i won't tell anybody i will just use it in my store <laughs> I think he should have, I don't think, I don't know, I just, I don't think he packed his box. Yeah, I know he has workers, like his family members and stuff, and I think they packed it, and I think someone got lazy. Because, oh, the markers come right off. This is amazing. It is so glossy. Like, how, uh, how do you do this? I'm so jealous right now. It's a little rippy. I'm gonna play with it a little bit before I put that in there. This is amazing. I don't care that it rips. It's so thick. Mine's so close to this, but I can't get the gloss. Like he has the gloss. Like how's he make his, how's he make it so glossy? Uh, how do you do this? I just wanted to actually play with it before I, I added the clay. Okay, I'm gonna put it back in. I'm gonna add this little ball clay that I put. I love Travis. My little artwork. My next victim is Jacqueline, whatever her name is. <laughs> I can't remember her name. The clay is a bit dry. It's gonna be in just an egg. I hope I'm not gonna have like pieces of clay everywhere. Oh, I am. Oh my god. I'm gonna have pieces of clay because the clay was dry. Like, did you think this through? Did you think this through? Didn't you know the clay was gonna dry out? No, my slime is ruined. I should not have mixed that slime that clay. I will, I'm gonna have to write him. Super disappointed, waiting for to hear back from Joseph Anthony Unicorn Slimes um, customer service. 
I bought his DIY slime Shopkins Easter egg. Super excited because I never got his slime before. And now I'm sitting here while I'm doing a review video. I'm sitting here picking out all the clay because it was dried out. And I don't think you should be selling a slime with clay that is dried out. And that's not the first thing that disappointed me. I also got my invoice that was ripped in half instead of cut. It was ripped. It was very unprofessional. My experience with shopping with his on his shop was so disappointing because I'm such a big fan. I'm just so upset right now. Just come home. I'm totally disappointed right now. Joseph Anthony Unicorn Slimes sold an Easter slime that had an Easter egg that, that had clay inside. And what you do is you put the clay from the, in the egg in the slime. And I put the clay in the slime and the clay was all dried out. Now I'm sitting here picking it out.
his slime does not suck. His slime is good. It's the clay is not good. It's hard. Guys, this one has to be continued because I'm sitting here picking out clay that is dried out from Joseph Anthony Unicorn Slime's shop. I'm really disappointed. I'm angry. And that's to sit here and pick out clay so I don't waste my money on slime. So what happened was that I wrote him on his DM because that's what he said on his card. He did have an email. I didn't see it. So because I do wear glasses, but I don't have him on. So he did have an email. I didn't see it. I DM'd him a bunch of times. He didn't answer me. So I started communicating him through his his com comments sections on his videos. Finally, he gets a hold of me and he wasn't as friendly as he is on video. He showed a whole different side of him. Like he was not the, the you know, unicorn Islamic Joseph Anthony that I was a big fan of. So it kind of gave me a sour taste in my mouth because he showed his true colors. He refunded me my money, but he did not speak about it. He did not ask me, how can we fix this? He didn't ask me nothing. I wanted the slime still. I wanted to ship the slime back to him to get a replacement, but he would not hear me. He ignored anything else I had to say. He just refunded me, and that's it, and never spoke to me again. Like, yeah, he said sorry, but that's it. And the other thing about his shop is he doesn't only make the slime. He has his, his family making the slime. If I'm ordering slime from your shop, I want your, you to be making the slime. I'm ordering that slime because it's you, your slime. It's your because you're making it because I'm a fan of you, and I want your you to be making my slime. He ha he doesn't make his slime. He he makes some of it, but most of the time his family, like a lot of like he has a staff of people that makes the slime. So like the box that I could have got could have been not even made by him. That's probably why I was messed up. When you have other people who's making your your product, things happen like that. They don't care as much as you do, and or maybe you just don't care anymore because it's all about the money. But you should not be having people make your product because people want you to be especially it's slime is personal, and I want the person I'm watching on YouTube to be making this slime that I'm receiving because I'm only buying that slime is because I'm a fan of you. And if you're not making the slime and I'm getting your mother's slime, that's not what I want. That's not what I signed up for. So like, that's not cool. I'm just saying, if you have a slime shop, you should always make your own slime. Yes, they can package the packages, but you should make your own slime. Okay. I might be wrong, but I've seen his mom make the slime. I've heard him say his parents are making the slime at numerous times in videos. And I, don't want your parents' slime. I want your slime. When I purchase through you, it's because I am your fan and I want you to be making my slime. I don't want your mother or your father making or your brother or sister making my slime. I want the person that I'm watching on YouTube make my slime because I'm your fan, not your family's fan. Okay. <laughs> All right, guys, I had a bit and I got that out of the way. <laughs> Let's get back to the video. I literally, I want to cry because I was so excited about getting his slimes because I'm so such a big fan and this is what I get the rip invoice and the clay I don't know what to think anymore I'll be back with a new video with um and letting you know what happened um for right now I just I have to get off I'm too upset to do the rest of the video I hope you um enjoyed the, the video that so far 
the rest of the, the rest of the video that I did, please don't forget to hit that like button and also hit subscribe so you can see more videos like this. Well, not like this right here, but the ones before this. And also hit the notification bell so you're always up to date with me and you don't miss out on nothing. Don't forget I'm having that giveaway. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you next time. Alright, love you guys. Bye.